Praise the Lord, Victory family and friends. Thank you for joining me this week for our Power Pack. I'm Robin Gould, pastor of Victory Christian Center here in Charlotte, North Carolina. I'd like to turn our attention today to 2 Corinthians chapter 3, one verse of scripture, and that is verse 5. It says, not that we are sufficient of ourselves to think of anything as being from ourselves, but our sufficiency is from God. I'll read the next verse. It says, who also made us sufficient as ministers of the new covenant, not of the letter, but of the spirit. For the letter kills, but the spirit gives life. Now, in the Amplified Bible, verse 5, the latter part says, but our power and ability and sufficiency are from God. Wow. Right before that, it says that we don't claim or count anything as coming from us. What am I talking to you about today from the Spirit of God? I think we need to make sure we do a checkup from time to time, making sure there's no arrogancy and pride, self-righteousness, you know, like we're something. Everything is from God. Our sufficiency is of God. We can't claim anything as being of us. Everything, every good and perfect gift has come from above. And so I just want us to make sure that we are always giving God the glory for everything. I mean, and never think that you know, I've arrived and I've made it and, you know, I've had some successes in my life, so I'm confident in myself. The Bible says that we put no confidence in our flesh. The Bible says don't think more highly of yourself than you are. Understand what Paul is saying. As great of a man of God that he was, the Bible says, and Paul said it by the Spirit of God, I am what I am by the grace of God. Everything is because of God. Everything is through God, in God, from God. It's in Him that we live and move and have our being. So our sufficiency, our ability to do anything, all of our gifts, talents, and et cetera, it's come from God, and it is from God. So let's give him glory, let's live for him, let's be grateful, and of course, my friend, let's walk in a spirit of humility. God bless you.